Hello and welcome to uh, Stopping the World. It's been a while. Um, sorry, I haven't been able to post a lot of podcasts because I have been traveling. And right now I am in Rishikesh, the yoga capital of the world, uh, checking out this yoga festival that happens here. At the foothills of the Himalayas, as you can see, I'm just sitting by the side of a, a little road you can see some monkeys in the distance you gotta be careful that they don't snatch the camera so anyway so i'm here to look for a little cave that belonged to a yogi called uh, tat wale baba now that name may not be very familiar to you because uh, he's not really very well known, but if you're familiar at all with with uh, the transcendental meditation movement with uh, Maharshi Mahesh Yogi, then there was well an accomplished yogi who was seen with him. There was quite a few YouTube videos um, where Mahesh Yogi translates talks by this advanced yogi and so he had an ashram right here in Rishikesh which is kind of really not very well known and not touristy at all and it's very difficult to find the place and I had to kind of uh, trek through Namaste Namaste I had to kind of trek through um, a little bit of a forest and uh, finally come to this place let me just show you where this is as you can see, so this is the road that passes behind Ramjula. And there's a little, if you see, there's a little uh, little path that goes down. So if you follow this, it goes down across a little bridge. And then you reach the famous Bhutnath Shiva temple, which is an ancient Shiva temple. And then the famous Parmat Niketan ashram in that direction. Anyway, so if you manage to find this spot uh, right here, well, you can hardly see it. There's a little path and you don't see any boards or anything because they want to keep it really quiet. Is the ashram of uh, Tatwale Baba. So just to give you a little background, Tatwale Baba, in my opinion, is perhaps one of 20th century's greatest yogis who sadly is not so very well known, not just outside, but even in within India. And almost everybody who came in contact with him, accounts of uh, these encounters, if you read, uh, they are all of the opinion that he was definitely an advanced yogi, if not enlightened. And he lived here uh, in the Himalayas, in, in Rishikesh, Right, so we're going to just see, I'm not sure if cameras are allowed inside, so I'm just going to walk up a little bit and see what happens. So yeah, so he was living here and, and um, giving his uh, satsangs here. And sadly, of course, if you know the story, he was shot dead by another jealous Baba who wasn't getting enough attention so it's a bit of a strange end to an advanced enlightened soul you might say Tatwale Baba was known to be very old when he died or when he was shot dead but he was uh, one of those yogis who supposedly stopped aging so uh, as you can see in these videos he looks like he's probably in his 30s or 40s but uh, the claim was that he was at least 90 years old at the time of his death and if you're interested in uh, learning more about his life then uh, i recommend this little booklet that's floating around the internet that you can easily find written by vincent tatsinski called uh, Tatwale Baba Rishi of the Himalayas. 
but I'm, in a way I'm kind of happy that this is not a very well known place because it's not touristy at all it's super quiet and um, let's see it's a bit of a climb up So I can hear people talking upstairs. See the road going down there. Namaste. 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 I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to के भगत है हां ये बाबा जी के भगत है अच्छा अरे बाबा जी के परिवार के हैं इनके इनके भाई हैं हम पुराने ये पुराने ही रहते थे पुराने भगत लोग हैं यहीं पर रहते थे पहले बैठो बैठो आप भी बैठो 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 हम तो अरे लो भैया वाले हैं अरे हम भी तो आप ही कर रहे हैं डंगर पालने वाले खेती करने वाले किसान लोग धन्यवाद जी आपके बराबर हम कहां हो सकते हैं नहीं भाई ऐसा कुछ नहीं है तो पेट ही पालने में हार जाते हैं <laughs> हम अपने पेट पालने में हार गए हार तो <laughs> अब हम अब हम कुछ तो पहाड़ पे बस गए आगे जी। कुछ बुड्ढे नीचे ही रह गए हां जी हैं तो अंदर जाके देखते हैं देख सकते हैं देख लो Okay, well. So the yogi who was living inside at the time said uh, cameras are forbidden so not able to show you a video of what's inside but I do see that there are pictures available on the internet of the interior of the cave and uh, a lot of videos and pictures already available and uh, this is uh, what the shrine looks like so out of respect I uh, did not take uh, a video footage of the interior but I spent almost 20 minutes inside sitting and meditating and I can honestly say that there's definitely a presence or a power in the cave. Uh, a sort of an, an atmosphere of peace and calm and uh, well, higher vibrations, if you will. <laughs> So the people here are uh, super Check this out, so I'm trying to uh
पेट भरा रहा कल पर तो भंडारा हुआ अच्छा उनको जरूरत नहीं है हाँ हाँ Beautiful animal. Small. Let's head upstairs. Little uh, shrine here. Beautiful little spot. So, um, as you can see, it's quite a secluded place and unfortunately I can't show the cave inside because it's kind of forbidden to take pictures and I highly recommend coming to this space and uh, you know, spending a f maybe at least half an hour to an hour just sitting and meditating. It's really, it's really something. And apparently there are a few more caves up here uh, that we can uh, take a look at. So we go up this little path. So as you can see, there's one cave up there. Where you could sit and meditate.
So there's another little path here, which seems to be kind of cut off and not sure where that leads, but we'll probably just go back. So uh, this turned out to be a rather short vlog because my battery uh, ran out of power on my camera. But I really, really recommend visiting this cave if you are traveling in this neck of the woods. Or definitely recommend reading this book or looking up this yogi if you are at all interested in this topic. So uh, see you soon uh, with a new video. Until next time, please subscribe to the channel, like, share, comment. Let me know what you think about this video.